Oh sh! What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hi, welcome back. Hello, Scooby Doo. What's up with you? Ooh, this is well. Mm -hmm. I like to eat feces. Mm, my mom says no, but I say I don't care. Mm. Just to clarify, he said feces, not fishies, because that would be cannibalism in what this case. What are you case. talking about? I said fishies. Uh, okay. Let's let's gaslight James. What? Huh? Yeah, we. we what? Said, yeah. What? Oh, he's so cute. Look at that. Too bad they kill him. What? I think. The he's, prescription frog? Yeah, he's made for the prescription eye drops. I oh. think they like. Uh. Well, may, maybe not. Maybe they just. Let, let's let's just pretend they just like take some of his tears or something. Uh, let's just roll all the way to freaking. That probably is what happens. I just didn't read. So where are we going now? <laughs> As usual. As so where are we going now? For the norm. Yeah. For oh, the norm. fuck you. We're going to the old man. That's how I. Oh God right, right. Damn it. That's how I know it's an old man because the guide said it was an old man. Yeah. Chaka. Yeah. What? Elliot was just telling me, speaking of frogs, I, when we were off screening getting over here, he was telling me apparently these little frogs in this area over here. Right. Yeah, apparently, I didn't know this. If you play all the ocarina songs or certain songs to them, they give you a heart piece? Yep. Is that it? How the hell are you supposed to figure that out? I told you, when you go to them, yeah. you pull out your ocarina, yeah. and then it goes... Da -da 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 -da. So you know it has to do with the ocarina. Yeah, I know it has to do so with the ocarina. You, but so then, if you play a song, you see a frog come out. Yeah. And then you. Yeah, but nothing you... happens. So then you keep trying other songs, and then you see another one come out, and then you're like, "Oh, two frogs came out." Okay. And then you know. Yeah, it's just very. Yeah. Yeah, that, that that makes sense. It's I guess. Yeah. Kinda. It's like solving a puzzle. It's just tedious, you know. How do you figure out anything in this game? You just fucking go just. I do action, agree. I that's I. I do agree. It's a little more cryptic than the other ones. Yeah. Okay. Cryptic. Yeah, that's the right word. Cryptic stuff. Yeah. It's mm. dumb. But it's not like. I mean, there's some things in the original Zelda. Like, how do you know to just bomb this random ass wall here with no markings to find this secret chamber with this good armor? Like. Or how are you supposed to know? Like, you just have to bush? light this one tree or bush on fire. Yeah. And, oh, it leads to something. Exactly. Now that's bullshit. This is bullshit. <laughs> At least it gives you like an audio cue and things like that. So. I mean, I guess you could say like, back then before the internet was a thing, they that it gave. The internet was out. Well, it wasn't as commonly used, yeah, I suppose. Correct. It, it gave, it gave people more of an incentive to buy strategy guides because it's like, totally. dude, buy the strategy guide Please and you'll learn all cut. the secrets. No cut. But now, whereas nowadays it's like, <laughs> <laughs> strategy guides only fucking losers use those, <gasps> unless you like to collect them. In which case, you're not a loser and you're cool. Or if you just like to use them because you like to use them, then you're not a loser. In another case, now nah, let's double down. <laughs> Fuck you if you use strategy guides. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh. All right, we're almost done with the trading game. Yeah, oh wait, shit! Right. Yeah. The frog. Okay, now we have to run to Death Mountain. This guy just cannot hold what? still. <laughs> I showed you the frog. What? It was too close. These, those eyeballs are so delicious. Cooked fried eyeballs. With yeah. Those. So you take the cute froggy and you kill him. Oh, man. Sad boy. Well, I mean, yeah. Well, yeah, no. I'm not even going to try and say, like, well, he could still be alive just without eyes. No. He did say he's going to cook the frog. Yeah. Poor little <laughs> froggy. <laughs> Big the cat would not approve. No? Big the cat would be fucking mad, because... Won't last long. Run as fast as you can to this thing, man. You're young, you can do it. And don't even try teleporting. Don't be a freaking cheater. Go! I heard that you don't have very much time to do this, so we gotta fucking book it. Yeah, yeah. Hi, horsey. I should have turned you around. Get on the fucking horse! I heard, like, you end this with a couple extra seconds. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know, that was a thing. <laughs> you destroyed the leaf platform? Yeah. Wow. Huh. I think I get all my carrots back when I teleport through here. All right, so should we fast forward this, or do we have no, anything no, no, because there's a say? race against the clock. Okay, let's let's see if we can do it. And by we, we mean you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Please, no chode sniffing. Yes. <laughs> God. All right. Go go go. Hmm. My little 
cousin was just texting me. He's like, hey, dude, did you ever get the Rivali and Princess ah! Zelda Breath Ooh. of the Wild amiibo? You're like, fucking nerd, no one gets that shit. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I, my mommy very kindly got me them for Christmas. My mommy's a sweetheart. My mommy and daddy tell me that I can stay up past 5 o'clock at night, and I don't know if I can do this without permission. Mm -hmm. Oity goity. Dude, your James impersonation skills are freaking top notch. Hi, I'm Jamesy Goity. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what? You I... Know, actually, uh, I did love the sprite of this. The sprite? Yeah, the little bottle of the teardrops. Oh, how it's like drops. shaped like a star. Yeah, I really like that. It is kind of cool. Kid, I was like, that's cool. It was my favorite one. Stars are just kind of cool in general, you know? Yeah, and it was blue, and I don't know, it just looks nice. It has gold. Yeah, is, is blue one of your favorite colors? Uh, no. Hmm. I just like blue sometimes. What? I, I, I'm sure I've asked it. What is your favorite color? Mm, changes from time to time. Like like I've said, I always Originally, think... Originally, it was orange, and then just like purple and fuchsia for a while, and now mm, it's... Yeah. I are can't you... really tell when things are purple that well, so... Yeah, dude, no, you have a purple... I know, I remember you always wearing a purple jacket. Yep, I still have it. The checker checker pattern it's not checker pattern it's a wood pattern it's like wooden planks oh it is yeah oh. i'll show it you after this oh. jog your memory <laughs> so i i saw i saw some interesting things on my phone this morning on the internet when i was waking up Botanical porn again i um <laughs> i uh i saw this video called uh it's called rendering at 5 a.m it's two years old it's this guy he's 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 in this uh, computer lab, mm -hmm. in which he takes game design classes at his college, I assume, and he's there at five a.m. rendering stuff. And he there's so many computers in the lab. What he did was he took the Gandalf sax video. Have you seen that? Oh, dun, 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 that's Epic Sax Guy. It's um, not originally from that. Well, Remember well, when I was telling you about Epic Sax Guy? Yeah. That's that's Epic Sax. That's the song from Epic Sax Guy. Well, like yeah, he took every computer and he put a loop of that yeah, video I've, I've on every single that. one in like a <laughs> store, right? No, in in his uh, college class. Oh, okay, well then he's not the first. I've seen somebody do that in a store. <laughs> yeah, it's that's cool. so awesome. Okay, this thing I said I was gonna have like a few extra seconds left. Nah, dude, you speed race Fourth through shit. that shit. Hey, buddy. Oh. Oh. I'm just a regular size sprite, expanded, extremely large. These guys are lazy buddy. as fuck. Yay, really? You brought me the eye trucks? Wicky, wicky, wowie, whoa. Okay, now right. we get to skip like three days. Oh, we do? Yeah, or we're going to, because it takes them three days to make the sword. Oh. Uh... Oh, do you have to use the sun song? Yeah, so we can skip that. Because <laughs> I'm just gonna play it six times. Yay! All right, see you in six. Oh, it's stone. That's awesome. It's just a, a voucher. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's well, my sister does that. And she says, James, why do you do that? It feels like you're talking down to me. It's like it does. Oh, it doesn't feel like you're talking down to me ever. Uh, you're a very respectful person. Um. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Um, Yay! Yes! Sweet. Oh, man. Yes! Who needs shields? <laughs> shields are stupid. Oh, and we just gotta keep that? Okay. Um, I lost my sword, but I have this voucher. Could I uh, have another one? So this thing, uh, it breaks after a while, no, while, right? No, no, no. That's the broken Goron sword. That's what I was trying to explain to you many times. Yeah, that's what I was confused okay, about. Okay, okay. So let me just show you, I guess. Why not? Okay. Fuck it. Let's, let's go on a little... We'll teleport there. Hi guys, um, this, okay, so James, just to, we're gonna cut again real soon. Okay. This guy, this guy is a con artist. You ask him to make oh. the big Goron sword, you pay him a bunch of money, he, you buy it from him, and it breaks after like 200 strikes or some shit, and then you have the broken one. This one does not break. This is oh, the real Goron sword. okay. Hey guys, welcome back. Hey, what's up? We have quite an interesting subject we'll we were just it. talking about off screen. We'll share it in the next episode. Yeah. It's hot. Yeah. Uh, it was like 14 minutes, but a lot of that was skippy. So, mm -hmm. let's go in the temple, baby. Yeah. Okay, now we can save? Nice, we got like the most tedious thing in the game game done. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Man, that took forever. Sorry about that, but that I mean, happens. 
It's something I wanted to do. Not everyone gets the big Goron Sword when they play. So is it more powerful than the Master Sword? Yes. Wow. A lot more powerful. Holy crap. I think. Jeez. Uh, They're like, the Master Sword is... Here's... Yeah, I already know. I need the... It seals... Sword. It's the Sword of Evil's Bane. It's the most powerful sword ever. <laughs> Not. Here, I'm, I'm gonna look it up real quick. Should we pause again? Yeah, sure. Fuck it. We'll pause. If it's too long. Uh, I'm the, curious. This, this isn't just... This should just be called... The pause the, it. The cut clip episode. <laughs> Master Sword versus Big Goron Sword. Oh, yeah. It's twice the damage of the oh, Master twice. Sword. Okay. Yep. Holy. And it has wow. way more range. Okay, Jeez. so we, we probably don't even need to cut that out. That was pretty fast. Yeah, okay, cool. Twice damage, but way more range, too. Are you sure, Elliot? It was like 15 seconds long. And your blocking is different. <laughs> <laughs> the viewers might be too impatient. They may have clicked off and been like, fuck these guys. Again, there's a difference between a one-time 15-second pause and a recurring Yeah, sure, sure. Okay. <laughs> All right. I don't really remember that much about this place. Um, other mm. than, yeah, let's lickety-splitty it. I gotta point this to this to like I don't remember. Fuck. I really don't Oh wait, that's right. One of these has is glowing blue fire and I can only see it with the lens of truth. Or not Whoa, what the God. I pointed it to the wrong one. What the Yeah, Whoa. we just fell through the floor. I kinda remember that. Well, I don't. I only played this on three DS back in college. Mm, right. Yeah, this is spooky. I feel like this would probably be spookier on this one. Mm. Okay. So we want to push yeah. So that one that's at the bottom right? No, it's this one. Yeah, okay. So keep going. Not here. Not here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay. Let go. Sweet! Yeah. I cannot wait until the next episode. Yeah. So we can talk about my... Oh! Know. Yeah, it's going to be hot, dude. Mm. We are going to take a little hiatus after this, though, for lunch. Yeah. I need my Mondo burrito from Taco Del Mar. Am I missing the lens? No, okay. Just want to make sure. Hmm. I still am. Okay, so the fire turned off on that one torch. Yep. Oh, wait. Well, it unlocked the gate. Okay. Okay, so we go through this wall, and then... Yeah, yeah, I fucking know. <laughs> Let's hope you don't skip anything that's legit important. Wow. This is creepy. That one has eyes. The other ones don't. <laughs> Uh, spooky scary. Spooky scary skeleton. Send shivers down your spine. They soon and soon and Oh my god, dude. What's going on? I don't know. It just keeps fucking reading. You know me. I don't fucking read. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, yes, I do. Don't try and read me, nerd. Let me see if there's an. Okay, so there's two. Oh my god! Is it because you're hitting A? No, I'm not even hit. I'm just walking close to shit. Uh -oh. Let's do the right handed rule. I'm picking. Right handed. Okay, wrong choice. Uh-oh. It's fine. This is super long range. See? Look how good oh, this thing is. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, dude. That's freaking sweet. Now that I know this, actually, you can get the big Goron sword. You can get it right away. Hmm. Huh. That should be the first thing we've done. <laughs> oh, well. Haters. Oh, so you have to wait for... No, I gotta kill this. Before the re-dead respawns. I don't think he'll respawn. You sure? I think so. I just gotta kill his keys. Oh, oh yeah, he's dead. He disappeared. Yep. It was the um, Stalfos that were coming back that one time. No, the big Goron sword is great because it has like one and a half times range too. Yeah. So dude. people who normally aren't in the blocking position, so like a lot of stuff is based on like how close you are. Mm -hmm. So the big Goron sword's so far away, it's like really good for smashing people. Yeah, dude, I like it. That's super cool. Yeah, yeah baby. And that with the big Goron sword is stupid. Mm. And that's really good. Yeah, it's just... Holy crap. You sacrifice some defense, but... Oh, I see. That's it. I see. Huh. Watch Maybe it's the ones... in the darkness. Tracks full of ill will. <laughs> you can't see the way forward. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I think it's the ones with the glowing eyes. They talk to you. Let, yeah, yeah, test yeah. My theory. Yep. Shadow the... Oh, okay. <laughs> you don't need to listen to me. Fine. Jerk! Oh no. Okay. This guy again. Dude, this is gonna be fucking easy town. Oops. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, it's Mr. Glob Glob. Yeah. <laughs> Swabble dabble dabble. Can I turn around, please? It looks like he's dancing to a beat. Yeah, it does. 
Yeah, this is not scary anymore. <laughs> Man. Oh my. Oh jeez. Ow! He just kind of gives you a Your booty is yes, nummy. Nom, okay. Nom. Oh, you broke his neck again. <laughs> that was so easy. <laughs> that was so easy. I jump stroke him when he was up. Do you see that? I, I think so. Damn, big blonde sword for the win. Man, dude. Give me the boots, baby. Oh, we're going to get the boots now? Yep. We could go to the spirit temple now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, we, we could do it without the boots. You don't need the boots. Right, right. You can go to the water temple, get the long shot, leave the long shot, do these two temples first, go finish the water temple last. Wow. Yeah. Huh. Yep. Yeah, you know, that's true. I never thought about that. Once you just... Yep. You just have to go halfway through and get the yep. item. Yep. Wow. Huh. Interesting. Okay, we came from the right last time. We're, we're almost done. I'm going to go back to the main room. Then we'll call it. You have the eye of truth. Huh? <laughs> yeah, just so you know, that voice, it's... uh. That's the Mad Hatter from Alice in Wonderland. Oh, nice. And also, oh yeah, did you never see the Disney animated Alice in Wonderland? The Disney animated one? Yeah, you know, the classic one. Oh, yeah, I've seen the classic. Yeah, and uh, it's funny, in Wreck-It Ralph, there's a character named King Candy, and he has the exact same oh. voice. He's voiced by Alan Tudyk, or Tudyk. <laughs> yeah, I know, we've talked about this. Alan Tudyk. Oh, Got him. <laughs> Next time, we go in here and we tell you a hilarious story that'll make you James and me cringe. Well, mostly you, but yeah. Okay. Bye-bye! Bye! See y'all! <laughs>